Hello everyone, and welcome to my Emmerdale News YouTube channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. Spoilers for Emmerdale's June 18 to 21, 2024 season are available. The following week, Belle King comes up with a risky scheme to end her pregnancy, while Mora Dingle resorts to extreme means to save her son, Maddie Barton, Rose Jackson's scheme is made public in the meanwhile. Furthermore, the distance grows between Manpreet Sharma and Charles Anderson. We can also witness an emotional outburst amid all the drama. For the complete story, read on. Watchers of Emmerdale will be able to witness Belle's battle with making a really tough choice in the next episodes. Belle Dingle wants to terminate her pregnancy, according to previews for Emmerdale. She is somewhat anxious, though, when she talks to the midwife about it. She will even schedule a scan appointment for next week. She then abruptly ends a call to a cap service as Tom gets home. Following that, Tom gives her makeup a praise, and Belle asks him to snap a photo while surreptitiously revealing his phone pin. Belle tries to use his phone to pay for the cab later on when Tom heads upstairs. Spoilers for Emmerdale state that she is taken aback to learn that he has been following her about. When she can't convince him to let her use the automobile, she feels completely trapped. Belle discovers an extra key later. However, should she use her own car to the clinic? Amelia Spencer consents to watch Piper in the scenes that come next. In the meantime, Belle slips her phone into baby as their stroller to prevent Tom from finding her. Spoilers for Emmerdale indicate that she is quite paranoid. Belle is utterly perplexed about her relationship with Tom at the clinic, but she is a dement about not becoming pregnant. Will she truly give birth to her child? We'll just have to wait and see. Then, Emmerdale spoilers affirm that Maddie is in a difficult situation while inside, particularly because he isn't receiving his medication and isn't even allowed to take a shower. When Mora learns that Samson would not stand up for him, she becomes concerned. However, Kane is right on the money. He knows the true culprit behind all of this chaos. He implores Samson to be honest and spare Maddie from suffering. According to Emmerdale spoilers, Mora has a strategy. As she heads to the Woolpack restrooms in the upcoming scenes, a significant event is about to occur. Mora humiliates Kane over dinner despite Kane's warnings not to meddle in Maddie's situation. When Kane reminds Mora about her harsh remarks the following day, she feels terrible about her outburst. When a drug and Kane later appears, his wife becomes frightened since her marriage is in jeopardy. Emmerdale spoilers indicate that Carrie may attempt to con Josh in the bar. Trying to get a confession in private, she tries to videotape their conversation. Still, her scheme fails miserably. When will the truth be revealed? Rose always giving Kim issues, and Kim is very irritated with her, and what do you know? Rose reveals to her buddy Ruby their cunning scheme to sabotage Kim's life and put a rift between Kim and Will. On a different subject, Dawn and Billy are ecstatic that they can now take even home from the hospital. But according to teasers for Emmerdale, Dawn is afraid about contracting infections and giving them to Even. In the meantime, Manpreet is motivated by Claudette Anderson to fight for her love with Charles. However, Bob Hope breaks down in tears when he sees Manpreet bring an overnight bag into the B&B &B Charles and Manpreet dating. In addition, Nikki learns that his father, Caleb, and mother, Rudy, participated in the hit and run that resulted in Ethan Anderson's death. He now begs his boyfriend, Suni Sharma, if they can go somewhere else together because he wants to leave them so badly. Will Suni go with him? What is Caleb's and Ruby's response to his choice? How do you feel? Let us know by leaving a comment below. After five years on the show, actor Jarrell Carter's character Nate is supposedly departing the Hamlet in dramatic scenes this year. Although the news has not yet been confirmed by the actor or the soap, rumors are that the explosive plot will go down in history. 
Nate will return to the show next week following a brief absence. In the midst of the character's depressing plot, he finds himself getting into trouble for his friend Billy Fletcher. After a trying time with his family, Nate encourages Billy to relax and enjoy a few drinks. According to spoilers, Evan, his infant son, was just diagnosed with leukemia and has been getting treatment in the hospital for many weeks. Now that Evan is free to go back home, his mother, Don Fletcher, is careful to maintain a bubble around the family in order to stop any diseases or viruses from spreading. However, because Don and Billy are in constant conflict over their mutual anxieties about Evan, he passes away the next week. Don starts to lose faith in Billy after Evan throws up his prescription while he is under his care. Billy accepts Nate's invitation to get a few beers because he wants to unwind. However, Billy consumes too much alcohol and becomes inebriated. Nate has to help him home. Naturally, this indicates that Billy has burst their bubble for even. While Kim Tate seems to be able to resolve anything, Kim fills in for Billy while Don worries about his absence. But when Evan becomes ill, panic ensues. Don is devastated to learn that Evan is being sent to the hospital due to a cough. Billy blames himself for Evan's cough and feels bad about not socially separating from Nate. Kim accepts responsibility and covers for Billy once more, only to have Don lash out at her. Will Nate ultimately let Billy go in it? And will he have more drama in store for him? It happens amidst rumors of Nate's departure from the show, with some viewers forecasting a tragic outcome. Laurel Thomas suffered a heart attack and was taken to the Emmerdale Hospital. The adored face is going through a trying time after learning Jay Sharma's Amit Sharma secret. In an effort to get retribution, Jay tormented his biological father after discovering that Amit had forced Rishi down the stairs just before he passed away. Then without bidding Suni farewell, he instructed Amit to sign over all of his shares in the Hay P Company and depart for India. Eric Pollard was one individual who was aware of Jay's dark side reappearing. He routinely visited the Hyde for free drinks, which allowed him to profit from keeping Jay's secret a secret. Jay became so irritated with Pollard last week that he snapped at him. This incident occurred in front of Laurel, who then insisted on knowing what was going on. Jay utilized the fact that Suni was in the shower when Nikki Milligan answered the door as the ideal justification to avoid talking to his brother. He left after telling Nikki not to worry, later running into Laurel at the chapel. When a disturbed Jay insulted Laurel's late partner, Ashley, Ashley, she got up, called him a pathetic guy, and told him to go. Laurel started to have trouble breathing as Jay walked away. Laurel's feelings became too much for her to handle, and she fell to the ground. Thank goodness, Gabby Thomas located Laurel and dialed 911. Jay was getting ready to speak with Suni in the hide, but he was getting annoyed with Gabby's phone calls. When he finally did pick up, he was shocked to hear about Laurel's fate. Jane watched outside the village as Laurel was wheeled into the ambulance. Suni attempted to reassure his sibling that she would be fine, but Jane wasn't really confident because he knew the doctors were operating under the assumption that Laurel had suffered a heart attack. Will Laurel, though, survive? Thanks for watching if you liked this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.